Hello, everybody. This is Andrea Lanus from Barcadero Technologies. I'm here today to present another new feature in Delphi 2010 and C++ Builder 2010. Uh, the feature I'm going to present today is the new DB Express driver for Firebird. Let's start to see how we support, how works the DB Express driver for Firebird. Let's start looking the Data Explorer. Here we have the list of drivers supported by DB Express. Now we have a new one here, the Firebird. And uh, on the bottom, we have the list of alias for each one of our uh, Firebird database. In this case, uh, I have the connection with my pictures database. Here you can see the connection, the username and password. And also you can open the advanced properties and you can change all the different uh, uh, we can change the other uh, parameters uh, of the Firebird connection. Let's test the connection. It's working fine. Let's open the connection in Data Explorer. And here you can see tables, views, procedures, functions, and synonyms. In this case, I'm going to open tables. I can look the fields and indices for each one of the databases. Uh, you can retrieve, retrieve the data. You can see here a lot of different data types. Also, you can alter the table if you want to create a new, a new field, uh, delete, you can change the data, uh, the table structure inside the ID. It means the driver support the uh, Firebird metadata, okay? Now, let's see uh, one application, one Firebird application using the client data set, using the DB Express driver, using blob fields, big int data types, and other, other data, uh, Firebird data types. Here is a, a Delphi application. And as you can see, I have a connection here with my Firebird database. I have the driver here using Firebird. I have the new library DBX FBDLL. This is the DB Express library. And here, the FB client DLL. This is the Firebird client DLL to connect to the database. Uh, I have my uh, SQL query, SQL data set in this case, doing a select on the table be alive. Okay, a client data set connected. And here, a uh, blob, uh, blob field where I have uh, an image. Okay, let's run this application. You can go through the records and also you can add another uh, another record or you can do any operation insert delete update wherever you want let's add some information here uh, let's give a name for this fish uh, let's see test zero one some notes and add a new image here. And now I'm going to save this information in the database. Now I have a new record here. And the information is inside my uh, Firebird database. You can come here in the SQL uh, in the Data Explorer. You can see here a new record. OK. And here my image. Now, let's see how uh, works the metadata support on the DB Express for Firebird. Uh, I have here a source code where I'm going to create a new table and add, I will add some fields and a primary key. In this case, I'm using the DBX get metadata meta provider okay, to get an instance of the pro connection provider. And I will start dropping the table because I'm going to consider this table already exists on the database. And here, I'm using the metadata class to create a table. I'm giving the table name. And I'm using the column uh, for each data type I need to use. In this case, I'm going to use int32. I'm going to use the Varchar column. And, and I have to use, in this case, the DBX Unicode Varchar column. Also, I'm going to use the binary long column that represent a blob field. Okay, and here I'm going to use, I'm going to add a double 
uh, a field with the data type double and using the default value 100. Okay, uh, after define the fields on my table, I just create the table. And here I have, uh, as you can see, uh, new uh, metadata to create the index. In this case, I'm going to create a primary key. I just define the table name, the column, and execute the, the create primary key method. After that, I just destroy the, the object. And here I'm adding, I'm moving, not moving, I'm copying all records. I have the BioLife table to the new table. Pretty much that. And I copy some columns. And also I'm going to copy the, uh, the graphic column. Let's execute this table, the, this, this application. Let's give the name here table demo. And now just execute. And here we go. We have the fields created by the DB Express metadata. And now I can navigate through the records. And I have this whole information here in the new table that I created using the DB Express metadata. So, as you could see now, uh, the DB Express provide full support for Firebird database. We bring the native driver for, for the uh, Firebird database and also uh, the full support on the metadata through the DB Express framework. Uh, hope you enjoy this presentation uh, uh, stay tuned in our website www.embarcadero.com for uh, the new RAD Studio 2010 and also uh, in our blog is blogs.embarcadero.com where you can see a lot of the new features is coming on the new RAD Studio 2010 thank you and have a great day